Absolutely. I'll say this, I know, on behalf of myself, I'm, I'm my own, this is, this video is going to be to my own account, so, um, the Calhoun County Sheriff's and the Battle Creek Police and the District and Circuit Court Judges of Battle Creek and the uh, City Leaders of Battle Creek know, I know you guys know, I know you guys are the uh, Battle Creek uh, courts and law know, are fully aware of who Jeffrey Scobie is and that I've been receiving uh, SSI social and supplement security since 1999 because Jeffrey Scobie is the one that got me in you know got me in to um, a SSI check I, I thought I was too good for um a government check until I real he he's like look I'm gonna get you the the checks I said well I'm gonna save it he said no I'm gonna make sure you get a check every month but you can't save it you have to invest it so well, at, over the years I learned how to pay uh, my court costs, my lawyer, my lawyers, you know, and because uh, I had to pay like over twelve or thirteen hundred to success in cash from SSI to successfully complete probation. Because when you because you got to pay the court the the court fees, your lawyer, the court you, you got to pay all that. In other words, when it comes to making money, whether it's a government check or a nine to five, every human being created in this world is, you know, is you're you're automatically qualified to break the law. You're automatically, but. There's different ways you can break the law, but and there's other ways you can handle your your uh your court your court uh your court dates and your court visits and talking to the judge and the plea. There's ways you can. There's different ways of handling that. So in other words, I'm, on my own account, I have caused a lot of disaster and and messes within my own family but the thing was I learned how to I'll just say the Holy Ghost and God's Spirit taught me how to use the money to invest in cleaning up my disaster my disasters and my mess a lot of people don't know how to do that there's, there's, any anybody that's born into this world in human form is subject to breaking the law. Either, either you become a judge, or a lawyer, or a prosecutor, or a cop, or you jo join the Supreme Court. In other words, if you're not working for the government and the law, you're pretty much either living the basic average life. Or you're breaking you're criminal minded. I don't know, I haven't met one person that's adult in my life that hasn't had a running with the law or worked with the law. I have used let me just put it like this. I've almost accumulated close to a quarter million dollars. And 22, 22 years through the government. And if I would have never had that money, I would have done, did something stupid and ended up dead or in prison. So, 
As for me and my household, I serve God, the Lord Christ Jesus, God's Spirit, and the Holy Ghost, a host of angels. But anyway, that's my house. This is my household, my body, my human temple. So in other words, when you, when you break the law and at the same time you're breaking the law by reporting people and getting other people locked up, the law eventually catches on to what these males and females are doing and they end up in a room and questioned by the, either the police or the feds, the federal agents. So in other words, if you're making money right today, if you make money today and you don't have a banking account, a bank account, a checking and a savings account at a bank, you might want to go Kellogg Community Credit Union. It's about 5, 10, 20 bucks and you can open up a checking and a savings. They'll, they'll give you a little card with your, your, your checking and savings account, um, you know, number so you can withdraw and deposit money you'll either get a master or visa debit card and guess what else you can do you can take that card when you get it it takes about a week or two and then you download your card your your debit your visa and mastercard debit card into your phone which you can run your phone you can run your business through your phone a lot of people, I'll just say this, I ain't going to say no names, but they they're, they fear downloading the app Snapchat, Instagram, and Facebook because they don't want them to be traced and states they're in and where they live. They won't even download Snapchat to video chat me because they're afraid they're going to be traced by the federal government. Okay? So... In other words, money is used to pay your court costs and your run-ins with the law so you can stay free. Because the more crime you do, either man, woman, or teenager, male and female, and you're not, and you're not getting caught, and you're not using the money, you're, and the money you do get, you're you're using to commit more crime, criminal activity within your neighborhood and within your own life. And I'm pretty sure the Calhoun County Sheriff's and Battle Creek Police, you know, all the way to the federal agents and the government, Supreme Court of America, the federal government of the United States of America, I'm pretty sure they're fully aware why God is doing in, in Christ Jesus and God's Spirit and the Holy Ghost and Lucifer and all the angels and the fallen angels and my family and my neighborhood, Battle Creek, Michigan, and America, the world, know why I'm doing what I'm doing. I don't, there ain't, there ain't really, there ain't really, you know, all I, like on a personal note that probably the Holy Ghost made me say as a healing from Christ Jesus for my health and my body to be whole. Some golds, diamonds, and platinums, and a half a million from God. I'm sure everybody understands now. God bless America. God bless the world. Honor, honor the veterans. Fly the flag. Independence Day, 4th of July. Now I'm going to label this I'm going to put the America, America flag emoji and I'm going to say God bless America. That's how I'm going to label this video on my YouTube channel.